just wrapped a quick training session where I am using just this big popper, a target with a no shoot, and this target. Have a blue barrel here and then two blue barrels stacked over here. There's the obvious two position work here from barrel to barrel and back and forth that I can do, but I can also start right in the middle. That's right, I can shoot this target, go over here, go over here. I have a lot of options with only three targets and one steel. As a mom, I really have to maximize my time in the range. So for my first stage drill, I started at this barrel and shot this target and then that one. So then I just hauled and ran over, making sure I kept the gun up to shoot this target and then transition to this paper target right there. For the next drill, I wanted to incorporate some empty gun starts, so I started facing the double barrel with an empty gun, loaded and drew and shot this target and then back down on this one. Then I popped a reload because it's a little bit awkward reloading in this direction as a right-handed shooter made sure my gun was downrange and I shot the popper and the paper. Then for my third and final drill, no reloads except for an empty gun start, I drew, loaded and shot this target, ran over really fast, got the gun up, shot the steel, Immediately transitioned to shooting this target on the move before hauling over, hard transition to that last paper. As you can see, I shot these drills a number of times today. Pretty happy with just a single D on this target. And this one, yeah, those no shoots don't make me so happy. And a couple of official Ds there, but this is a really tough shot. Now you might be asking, what is that? Ask me checking my zero at various different distances. This is a three round group at 10 and 15, three at 25 and, and then these three right here, those are at 40 yards. I will take that. I'm a little bit high off my aiming point, but that's a really small aiming point at that distance. And shooting fixed sights. I know exactly where I need to aim for each target distance. Very important stuff to know. There you have it, a barrel here, a double stack barrel here, a single open target, and then one that's set up a little bit more difficult with a steel. So many possibilities. Oh, 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 and one last tip. Yeah, I only shot a couple targets from each position. That's because I'm training for IPSC, where all of those setups are absolutely critical. Now, you can certainly shoot more targets from each position for your training, but if you have a limited number of rounds, this is a great way to maximize them.